so hi guys i did a video i think maybe like two years ago i showed what i had on my phone um so i'm doing an update on it i'm actually planning on doing an update on every single video i've put out so um yes update what's on my phone i think i've added a couple more apps since the last time that i had apps on there so um i think we should start from this back page so i have facetime calendar this one's actually come with the app or with the phone photos camera da 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 da, da, da you know and then so finance i have just these here yeah gt bank and kuda and piggy vest lifestyle i have podcasts tv so these three up come with the phone actually everything on this first page comes with the phone so this is like um a positivity app self-care app <laughs> positivity so it just every day it uh, sends you notifications like you know all of these positive things so it sends to you you can let me see I mean you can set how many you want in a day and um, between like the times that you want them so that's that for that um i have flow app and um, there's this fitness app that came when i um when i updated to iOS 16 love nudge is a oh okay so i don't have internet because i put off my internet so that I, I can record without disturbance but basically this is an app for lovers and it just i don't know you put yourself on your partner and you have emotional tanks you know your partner or banks i think banks or tanks i don't know but you that try i think you try to feel the i don't know but it helps you keep up with your partner's love language um i have the countdown app it's just basically to come down to the next trip or when you're going to see the, uh, your special person next or like you know just basically counts down as the name implies um settings contacts files find my translate and that's it so now to the good stuff i have pics at viva videos so i use viva video to edit videos pics to edit my pictures um presetters presetters um i use for stock images okay so because my internet is off um and i just don't want notifications to come in so it won't load but um you have stock pictures here in short i used to actually no pexels has this is one that has stock photos again because there's no internet it won't show this has stock photos and presets as well so you can just get presets for all your photos to edit all of your photos so there's that lightroom for editing pictures imovie comes with the phone snapseed for editing pictures quick for editing videos photo grid for pictures cap cut for videos light clip for pictures face app for look i don't know why i have so many photo and video apps i had okay i take pictures but i hardly ever edit the pictures anywho so those are all my apps for photos and videos notice how you know all of my apps are in folders so after that i have the utilities folder voice memo compass measure calculator all come with the phone so i have zender i have true color i have bolt total this total is to be able to download stuff from the internet because you know you know how ios behaves and i have swift key and then nigeria railway corporation so for my kaduna abuja trips i book my tickets on here i have instant notion is to if you use notion what instant notion does is to help you bookmark things that you see on um twitter wherever and then you just bookmark it to your notion street i have stickers i used to create stickers then my airtel for my my fi so um, i have this this is where i check my balance check everything recharge and do all of that next to work so i have anchor for podcasts square for i really wish you could come okay so square is like a mini pos for business 
okay so you can't come on because there's no network um but i have products there i issue receipts on there and just impute everything invoicing this is the app this is wave invoicing actually i use it to create invoices and sometimes give receipts from there this is whatsapp business so um this is whatsapp for my business line i have medium because i write on medium free upwork freelancer so this is upwork i really need to be serious with upwork and i have canva everybody knows canva i actually haven't touched it in a couple of days hence this blue thing by the name because i haven't touched it since it updated and then we have notion so what notion is i don't think oh, okay so cool these are all the things that i have here on notion so i'm planning an abuja trip which i think might not happen i'm not sure but i doubt it's gonna happen i stay planning it early and now i think it's not gonna happen anymore but you know fingers crossed we'll see so these are all of the things that i have on there i just want to quickly show you one of them um okay so this is like a journal you have what you want to do for the rest of the year da, 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 da. Um, so here you have your bucket list library budgeting reflection and gratitude this is like your weekly or monthly calendar so you put stuff on there like that yes i also created a portfolio here so for my ugc i created a portfolio and this is what it looks like um you know put the benefits of using ugc you just see that i can create so i have pictures videos and experience and the surprising here and getting things done here as well um but yeah that's it for notion i have sandbox sandbox is a logistics app i want to call it so you can ship things from here and so you just um plan it here plan plan should do your trip here your delivery here and then um but for now i think they have just dhl on there so dhl picks up and you know your item is shipped recording studio it's i think it used to be called spreaker but it's called recording now and it's for podcasts um wordpress slack because um you know work and all and then figma figma for designs feel like everybody knows figma even if you don't use it i feel like people talk about it so much so everybody knows figma here i have all my google apps google gmail chrome classroom classroom for all of the tutoring that i do youtube drive calendar and maps okay social networking i have whatsapp i have twitter instagram pinterest telegram clubhouse signal linkedin facebook i hardly ever open facebook i don't even know why it's here but um i don't know it's there tiktok snapchat and zoom for my books and references i have flipboard bible books um so i'm currently reading what am i currently reading one of us is next i think yes so i haven't read today <laughs> um and these are the books i've read this year 12 books read this year but um yeah i still have like five to go i think i haven't read today so this is what i'm reading now one of us is next i'm also reading talking back to the purity culture so i'm reading both both of them together um i have my office udemy bible study so this is another bible app this one lets you have sermon notes within the app so you know you're writing your sermon notes you, you are writing um the scriptures you can just quickly click go to the scripture and come back to your um sermon notes without leaving the app so that's why i like that then duolingo because we're all learning languages um okay ig third party i have buffer i used to schedule posts for twitter and instagram Planoli to schedule posts for instagram because i have like 1 million instagram accounts um preview to schedule posts for instagram as well insta save to you know save so sometimes what i do is i repost stuff on my con on my page um so i just use insta save to save it and then repost business suits for um facebook business what else 
media and entertainment. I need to entertain myself. So there's Shazam too, because I'm always hearing music, even on my phone, even on Instagram, and blah, 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 blah. So I just use it to search. Candy Crush, because what is life without Candy Crush? Netflix, Spotify. I downloaded Spotify when um, um, Apple said misbehaving, and now I think we d they've taken out the $20 limit, so I don't think anybody in. I'm not sure we can even renew the music subscription. I don't even know, but um, I have Spotify, and I don't know how to use Spotify, because the songs never always... like. So you click a song. I, I don't know. The song's never... It's never what you want to... It's, I cannot even put my sentence together. But it's never the song that you click on that plays. I don't know why. Always. You click on the song, it brings out an entire album. Like Spotify confuses me. You know. And I have VLC. I'm not sure what I have here. Okay, so my friend's anniversary. I think I probably deleted the other stuff I had here. Uh, yeah, I probably deleted everything else. So this is my friend's video um, from his anniversary. They did a video, he and his wife. Four picks, one word. Zuma, Subway Surf. So those are all those three uh, games. Um, I think this is the last. Oh, okay, yes, that's the last folder. So I have my, before I go to be my eyes, I have my phone icon, Safari, messaging, and music. Be my eyes is... Um, be my eyes is an app that helps you or that lets you help blind people so basically okay so the internet connection i can't show you basically once some a blind person needs your help you get notified you answer the call it's automatically a video call and then you help them so you know if they're trying to pick something they're trying to choose something they're trying to read something you just help them through it it's actually a good app especially if you're looking to you know contribute to humanity in any way that you can so yes 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 that's it um those are all the apps i've had to delete i think i deleted maybe like uh can we check i deleted like no there's no way to check i don't know it, okay no network i deleted probably like six or seven because i didn't have space and my phone was beginning to like act up so i had to delete i think maybe like six or seven apps but these are the apps that i have currently which of these apps do you use let me know